Hey, how you doing folks? We're, uh, this is my system. It's 4,200 watts of solar. And I got 2,000 watts worth of wind power up there. Right now we're getting in the shade and oh, back there, that is a 1,065 watt solar panel. But this will get me through, through any kind of ice storm, hurricane, anything like that. Uh, on a big scale level to keep my refrigerators, deep freezers, everything going. And back there, these two panels are from a small 12 volt system. Back there, is, these panels are from a small 12 volt system slash grid, grid tie off grid hybrid. This is also a hybrid system here. Grid tie and battery backup. And I'll get you a closer look of those. My finger keeps on getting away. And these are all Kyocera solar panels from way back, 2009 I started. Uh, so let me give you an update. And you can tell they've been there a while. You can see some growth <laughs> growing. <laughs> they have been there for a while. Let me give you a closer view, but. 2009 yep that's just uh, some just some growth no big deal but I do wash them all that good stuff but they're holding up really good so they last a long time and I'm one of the first ones to ever do solar in my area that is and these are panels on the back utilize any every bit of power you can get so in the winter time you know, these get a lot of solar and it's still got some sunshine on them right now and they're still making power and i gotta fix this hate when that happens oh well i don't think it's a whole lot of fix on that but anyway that should be up there i'll fix that here shortly Anyway, let's take you inside. At least I know what I got to do. Well, I showed you my earlier 12 volt system in the first shop. And that's the bigger, and that's batter, batter bank down there in that box down there. And there's the grid tie system. And then here is the big boy, the Outback. Turn some lights on. Woohoo, voila. And bringing 840 watts. Mm -hmm. And this is, uh, this is a heck of a day. And I got three charge controllers. These are the flatter roofs, flatter panels on the roof array. They're putting out about 70 watts right now because they're in the shade. This is uh, one of the two poles on it. And this is the one in the garden right here. 660 watts. So it's that time of day. But we're making power and the bat batteries are all healthy. And there's battery banks down in there. Have you all seen it in my other videos? And these are giants, AGMs. So, and there's the the uh, the Mate 3S. Kind of shows you everything that's going on. And there's the old power meter. That's how much power I've been making since the start. All right. Well, I'm going to wrap it up. The wind turbines are cranking. Two amps, four amps, eight mile an hour wind. I need to stop. But anyway, you, I got wind turbine video too. You got to check them out. All right. Well, anyway, folks. I just want to share it with y'all about my system. Update. Everything's going great. 
We're getting ready to be a snowstorm, a heck of a whopper on a, in here in Virginia. We haven't had, seen one in years. All right, y'all. Well, I'm going to say God bless, simplify. Please subscribe again. And thank y'all for watching. And y'all have a good one, y'all. God bless, simplify. This is Keto Uniform for Sierra Mike Charlie. Or KBUSMC. Just don't call me late for dinner. All right, y'all. Y'all take care now. Bye-bye. Okay, folks. I'm just showing you what I'm running with that new grid tie inverter and off grid it's these are two monocrystalline high-tech solar 100 and 180 watts each so 180 watts times two that'd be like 360 yeah 360 watts all right so that's what we're pushing that's what we're using I'll show you the backside. This is a, Mar a Mars solar mm -hmm. uh, solar panel mount. And right back here. The sun is bright today. Getting ready for a little snowstorm. Right here you are. Got them connected in uh, parallel. So, series, excuse me, series. Two 12 volt panels in series. Excuse me about that. All right, now I'm going to show you inside, see what we're doing with the production. This is another part of the video. All right. There's some lights on here. And uh, just hooked it up yesterday. And uh, I commissioned it yesterday. And it seems to be doing really good. So right, and there's, it came with a meter. Kilowatt hour meter. That's really handy. Also, I got a um, the kilowatt hour meter going to the socket, and this thing will blink on and off. Let you know it's doing its thing, and it tells you what's what it's on there for. It's a uh, red protection, green search and lock. So I'm I'm pretty happy with it. Got it on eBay. But anyway, y'all, I just want to touch base, let you know what going here going here. And my other one is set up to my off grid, which right now mm -hmm. we're running uh, we're running the off grid inverter to charge up my Dewalt power station. Uh, just in case you never know, lose power, we got other means of power. Yeah, but that's a good unit, that little bit of wall power station, portable power station. Cut this off. 13.7 volts, zero watts. This is Antrax Solar Inverter Freedom Series. Freedom X 2000. I'll cut that off. I'll unplug this. Had to cut off. Whoops. <laughs> anyway. All right, y'all. Back at, after a while. All right, now. Bye-bye. I'll see you on the next one. Hey, folks. This is uh, this is Kenny, our Keto Uniform 4 Sierra Mike Charlie. Just doing a video on my Solar Epic. Micro grid tie inverter, whiskey visker, Whis whiskey Victor Charlie dash eight eight hundred eight hundred watts. I'm um, pushing uh three hundred and some watts grid tie inverter, but then when it goes out, I can go, I can go off grid, 
or grid tie. We grid tie when the sun's up and down and running, but when the um and when a grid goes down, I got ways to flip it and have grid tie. I mean, off grid, excuse me. And uh, and it's got even come with a little power meter, which is pretty cool. I got it off eBay, and I'll put a link down below. Really good, folks. Really nice and broader. And it's got it's all this is up safety safety codes and this and you know all, everything. And then here's my my kilowatt uh, meter. That's what I put up today so far, and that's only three hundred. 320 watts. So, here we go. Now, there we go. Yeah, I thought I'd share that with y'all. Solar Epic. I'll put a link down below. Everything's grounded. Good to go. And... There's my, and that's off my off-grid, other off-grid setup. And you can see that's showing now 20 watts because it's, it's floating. It's good to go. And there's my backup to charge the batteries in case, you know, I've got them all in grid tie mode. All right. All right, folks. Hope you all enjoyed the video. We're getting ready for a nice little snowstorm in this part of Virginia. All right, so we ain't seen that and gosh, like uh, been a lot of years, a lot of years. I think about six, six or seven years, but it's coming this way. All right, y'all. Y'all, thanks for watching. God bless. Simplify. Please subscribe. Hoorah. All right, y'all take care now. Bye-bye.